Hey guys and welcome back to the series of how to do online school. My name is Brittany and today I'm here to show you guys 7 best apps and programs that every student should know about. So let's get on to the video. So coming with the first program is a grade calculator. Now I do understand that there's multiple different versions of these but this is my all time favorite as I can include my tests, my assignments, and anything just related to the class and just see the current mark that I do have at the moment and then I could also plan for how much I'll need to get on a test or an assignment in the future and then just kind of plan forward from there to see okay okay, I need to do this, this, and this, and then I'm blessed. And now coming up with the second app slash program is SPC and Uni Days. Now this is the best thing ever for students as it gives you the best student deals from almost any website, almost any store, and you know as a student we do tend to struggle with money. Hopefully with this it does help you save a lot more money, a lot more time, and just access all the websites, all the prices, and all the deals within just a click of a button. And also checking out electronic websites just like Apple, just search up Apple education prices, and then boom you get your student deals but also remember that these are student deals and sometimes they'll need you to prove that you are a student by including your student email or your student number so Again, this is specifically made for students. Now coming in with my third favorite app slash program is basically Evernote and also OneNote. Because these two programs are just very versatile and you can just access it almost anywhere from your tablet to your phone to your laptop. So I can do my notes on my laptop and then if I want to continue on my phone, I continue on my phone and then vice versa. And then you can also add little doodles, drawings for specific notes. Maybe if you want to draw a chart, if you want to add in a graph, if you just want to do like a little human biology diagram. They provide tools for that and I just absolutely love it. And I just find note apps super useful as you can always attach PDF files, images just to make your notes a lot more clear. So definitely check out those note apps. If not, there's a lot of other alternatives. My fourth favorite program slash app, I believe a lot of people have heard of this and it's called Quizlet. Now Quizlet is absolutely amazing as it's basically an online flashcard program where you can make flashcards for your notes, tests, and just anything etc. And a lot of times people do share their Quizlet notes that way so if you do have a similar program you're most likely to find a Quizlet folder for that. And someone already made all the notes for you now all you have to do is just study them and I feel like that's amazing now coming in with my fifth favorite program and it's called quillbot now if you ever find yourself stuck trying to summarize a paragraph or you're having trouble to understand a paragraph quillbot basically just simplifies whatever you're trying to read or whatever you're trying to write and just shortens it and just makes it a lot more creative if i must say so if you're reading an article online and it's just not programming into your brain copy and paste some parts of the article that you don't understand it paraphrases it into a simpler context and then it's a lot more easy to understand whatever you're trying to read. Now my sixth favorite program slash app that I like to use is the Citation Machine. Now yes again there may be different sites that are pretty similar to the Citation Machine but this one I find a lot more reliable for me because it usually has a lot more options whether you're looking for APA version 7, APA version 8, MLA it has it for you. You can specifically put in descriptions of the information you want. So first name, last name, title, date, etc. You kind of look through what you have to cite and then it basically makes citation for you and I saved a lot of time with this just with every citation machine just double check all the information is correct in the right place because we don't want anyone to get in trouble now coming in with my absolute favorite program slash app that I would like to share which is number seven and that is to always look for the free programs that your school has to offer. A lot of people don't know this, but a lot of times your school, as in university and colleges, do provide free programs for students because being a student can be difficult and money can always be a tough subject. So they do offer free programs for students. I was able to get Microsoft Office for free as I'm registered to York University and they provided free Microsoft for students. I was also able to get a free antivirus program for my computer, like, whoa it's totally safe it's totally free and it's totally allowed as these are free programs the school is providing for its students search up your school name with free program at the end of the sentence and you're most likely to find a page where they have the free programs for the students and those were my seven favorite programs slash apps for students and i really hope you guys liked it and i guess i'll just see you all in the next video bye guys